least I think you know here at Expresso, we truly are a family. And so when one of our own is happy, we are all happy. We mm. share in that happiness, just like the moment our Zoe, she got to have her own fairy tale wedding and it was beautiful. Robbie was gorgeous as well. <laughs> Lucky enough for us, some of the family was there to witness. Um, and of course, you can all witness and catch it on the Insider SA tonight. And of course, Zoe is joining us all the way from literally as far away as she could be right now, along with Lucian and Ryle and myself. A very good morning. Is that right, Zozo? How are you doing? Morning. Good here, Zoe. Oh, we've missed that smile, Zoe. Oh, no, I, I can wait. Now I can hear you. Hello. Hello, Zoe. First of all, on your honeymoon um, about halfway through, how's it going? Uh, I, I won't say we're halfway through yet. I don't want to wish time away. But it's been so incredible. I mean, we are already going into dinner time now, so the time difference is huge. But it's been such a fun trip. We were in Sydney for a couple of days. We went to Bondi Beach this morning. We saw the sunrise, which is, I think, probably the most iconic beach that every South mm. African thinks about if they think about Australia. But it's been really lovely. I will admit, very expensive on the South African rand. But it's been <laughs> such a fun experience. It's also my first time traveling overseas with my husband. Oh, yay. And we can see your eyes light up. And, of course, some of our own was there to witness what looked like the most magical experience. Raul, I'm going to put it to you because you got stuck in, boy. Yeah. Um, what was the, the night like? It was an absolutely incredible occasion. For me, what stood out the most was the fact that Zoe and Rob have such incredibly close and loving people around them. Their Every tribe. single yeah, person 100%. there was just there for the love, for the celebration. I met such incredibly warm people as well. And I think that was really the sentiment for me that stood out for the day. It was like a huge family coming together and celebrating. It was absolutely beautiful. And of course, the bride and groom looked incredible to say the least, blessed with beautiful weather too. It was like, it was written in the stars for sure. Uh, someone else who looks incredible <laughs> in these visuals, Look at uh, this Mr. One. Lucian Albertain. <laughs> you know that an event is not an event until Lucian has arrived and given it his stamp of approval. Um, we know Carl was involved as well as the MC, mm. but because you normally have to control all of us, you yes. had a night off that night it and was you used it. <laughs> stunning. Firstly, um, Carl did an amazing job as an MC. Mm. He was incredible. He was, as amazing. always. And yeah. Zoe and Robbie were just magical. Oh. A family, everyone. It was just absolutely beautiful. And I, we couldn't be more happier because we lived our best lives. <laughs> was Zoe yeah. and Robbie and the entire family. And we felt so included. So included. And it was just... Uh, yeah. No words. I, I've heard such glowing reports about the chemistry between everybody. So um, I'm waiting for Robbie to walk past in a <laughs> towel behind you or something, which would be perfectly okay. I, I perfectly. I just warn him, please don't look past now. We are on national TV. <laughs> um, I absolutely love the Can fact. I just just very quickly, so best moment of the wedding? Oh, you know what? I think uh, one of the things we wanted with the wedding was, uh, I say, and I think this is something we always had to go back to, was Robbie wanted to see me in a white dress and man Cindy Bam came through with the most beautiful dress and I wanted my dad to walk me down the aisle. Those were the two <laughs> key points we always went back to when we um, planned this whole wedding. So that for me was the highlight that we were able to have all of our family around us, have our closest friends around us and it was just the most beautiful venue um, and it really was just the funnest day ever I think this was the long the latest I've stayed awake I was one of the last people to leave my own wedding Good which girl. was so much fun uh, I'm so glad you stuck to that because I remember saying to you, the only rule is you've got to be the last people to leave oh, yeah. the dance floor. Yeah, they too. won. Um, they won. Exactly. They won. <laughs> no, no, I was going to say, that would be a given. Four in the morning. <laughs> yeah, baby. Well, here's the beautiful thing. So we're going to wish you yeah. and Rob all the best and say uh, a very fond farewell. Another bon voyage, if you will. Soak up every second. You've had a really, really challenging and wonderful year. You've earned the right to savour every second of this holiday, of this honeymoon, baby. Yes, You're yes. a married lady. You're off the market. Oh, um, and we love you. the fact that you are so happy. <laughs> yes. Oh, man. Our Zozo oh, living you. her you best life. Unbelievable. 
Oh, man. And she got the brief as well in terms of wardrobe. <laughs> Very nice. Well, guys, the joy, we get to live those moments again. And if you'd like to see more and watch Zoe marrying the man of all of our dreams, then tune into the NCR Day SA tonight, 6 p.m. only on S3. And here's a little sneak peek. I'm wearing my dream dress from Cindy Bam and we went for a modern romantic feel. I wanted my dress to scream Vogue, modern bride, and so we just did a little bit of beading at the top and then for me the best part is the buttons running all the way down to the bottom. Catch this party of a summer wedding as Expresso presenter Zoe Brown and civil engineer Robbie Anderson say, I do. That's the Insider SA, this Monday at 6, repeat Saturday at 1pm and Sunday morning at 10.30 on S3.